Damn. Alright. I haven't been sending you on missions. Alright. Bountiful yield. A task just for you. Oh, thank you, Master. Alright, let's talk to Teak. No, no, no. This would not do at all. I wanted expendable testers. I made that very specific on my order form. What, does, what good does a Sith do me? I break you, someone's going to slice my head off. Go, and bring me back someone who no one will miss if they die. That's big talk for a worm like you. I am Teak. I'm a tier 6 inventor of Research Core 8 of the Imperial Science Bureau. I have just designed a portable oscillator to strip the native's droids of their shielding so the slightest blast to hit will destroy them. Once I test it under field conditions, it can be mass manufactured and distributed to every soldier on the planet. By all means, continue. It collects solar radiation and oscillates at a precise frequency to... Never mind, you're no scientist. All you care about is if it works, not how. Once it's powered in a solar receptor, the oscillator is what you call point-and-shoot. I will give you the location of both the power station and the droids if you truly wish you test it for me. Technically, I didn't say that I would, but okay. Since you promised to give me the XP's... Oh, let me sell this lightsaber. It's just taking up space. What's it look like? Guess we'll never know. Actually, wait. It's a pretty boring looking one. Ooh! That one actually looks kind of neat. Which, you have to really zoom in to tell the difference. Oh, what lightsabers look different. Notice. Nobody else will know but you. Damn it. I hate that. Alright, Tulek. Of course. Alright, let's go over here. Womp rats. Wonderful. Hope. Prehistoric archaeological find. Wow. Ooh, what's this? Bloodseeker Skeek. This is an interesting looking planet. I mean, for being necessarily bland, being like a this desert, I almost said a desert planet. For being a desert planet, it actually looks pretty, pretty neat. But, we'll see how I feel after, you know, eight levels. Is there pod racing? God, I hope not. There should never be pod racing in any Star Wars anything. Viper Fang Rill. I'm also just kind of looking around for um, Datacrons. Since I completely failed to find them. Oh, damn it. You know what? I'm going to get these quests later. Is there a um, taxi here, though? Yes, there is. I'll go ahead and grab this taxi, at least. Because I'm skipping a, quite a bit of stuff just going straight to this. this. My Lord. But I, I kind of just want to do fun. this just to do it. Because then I want to kind of focus, 
or try to focus on the story quest to get um, this other companion just to try him out. To be honest, I highly doubt I'll keep him. But, um, yeah. Well, the part about the Nar Shaddaa Datacrons is I never even saw them. That's what annoys me, is that I completely just didn't see them. Sand people. Dirty sand people. Go back to your own country. Oh, wait, no, this, this is their country, right? Never mind. Uh, sand motherfucker is about to get owned. Down went and effed with the wrong force user, bitches. Does he have both his AEs on again? Oh, he needed to cleave. Hey, a do back. Uh, yes. A healing sword. A healing sork is a caster that basically heals kills from rich. I'm going to grab this quest just because he's out of the way. And I don't want to take a chance at missing it. Unacceptable. You are not at all what I specified on the requisition form. What am I supposed to do with a Sith Lord? You completely invalidate my test results. Go back to the Bureau. Tell them when I ask for disposable testers. I mean it. Uh, this sounds familiar. You'll have to do better than that, you freak. That is why I always specify defenseless test subjects. I am Jeek. I am Tier 6 Inventor of Research Corps 8 of the Imperial Science Bureau. My newly completed Control Corps nullifier will subvert droid programming, rendering them harmless, or it should. It requires testing. What exactly does this entail? There are some hostile droids in the vicinity. They'll have to take some damage to expose their Control Corps. Once it's unshielded, use this device. Theoretically, it will subdue the droid. Theor I like that. Theoretically. Yeah, theoretically. Theoretically, it won't blow up in your hand and make you sterile. Alright, where is this thing? So the one guy was Teak. This guy is Jeek. Oops, wait. He killed him too fast. Damn it. You can only use BDL on what? Maybe it's this one. There we go. This should have been gone. Ah, damn it. Relock this. Oh, that's cool. I can knock this one out real quick. What quest is this? Eradicate assassin droids. Okay, obviously it doesn't work on these. Or those. Oh, he's not dead. Heal up. Uh, Sith Sork and Sage Sork are pretty much identical. 
Oh, it's only these that I can do. Right. Uh, control erratic assassin droids. Hello? His health is definitely below half. Here we go. Uh, yeah, I mean, all, yes, all the skills are the same. Get back. Yeah, these are for a different quest. Uh, erratic assassination droids. Yeah, I'm just knocking this quest out because it looks easy. I only need to kill... I only have to uh, get four of them. There we go. <laughs> oh, sweet! Thanks! <laughs> that was helpful. You're a helpful young man. Go talk to Jeek again. For some easy XP. I've finished testing. Your device works. Of course it works. If it didn't, I probably would have exploded in your hand. At that range, it would have killed you. It probably would have exploded in your hand. That you are alive is a testament to my genius. Now, if you'll excuse me, I want to see the envy on the faces of my colleagues as I report the success. Wow. Kimball's reinforced pants. Ooh, those are an upgrade. <coughs> I'll go ahead and take those. Sure. Let's hit bun buttons at random. How about that? That's more like Kimball's reinforced skirt. But whatever. It's an upgrade. What's a good s movie on Netflix? That seems like a random question. Uh, I'll tell you a good movie. Uh, Troll Hunter. I like that movie. Heroic Area. Hey, it's a pretty interesting little flick. Oh wait, what good stuff did you miss? Oh, hello. Oh, you missed, yeah, you missed some of my class quests. Uh, I am about to do a quest for Kim Vol, though. My first uh, companion quest. So there is that. Uh, more quests that I'm completely ignoring, but I will grab this bind point and speeder or taxi area rather. Oh, you missed my new helmet too. Yeah, I'm still not sure if I'm going to keep the look or not. Oh, sir, sorry to bother you. But I'm running inventory on our water rations. Yes. He said inventory. It appears you've exceeded your designated allotment. 
by a lot, actually. It's this bloody heat, Private. Makes me sweat. I need my baths. Uh, right. It's just that water's rather scarce out here, so if it's not too much trouble... I'm willing to make a few concessions for this planet, but my hygiene is not among them. Man, if I could force lightning and force choke and lightning skewer that guy at the same time, I would definitely do it right now. Oh, what the hell? Did it move? Damn it. This place is too big. Wow. Holy crap, that's a lot of desert. They did a good job on that, making giving you that feel of holy crap desert. More sand people a holes. Abandoned drifts. I'm actually about halfway through this level, too. Don't you do it. Yeah, that looks pretty, uh, pretty distant. I like that. It's a pretty neat look. Every planet takes a long time to load, though. <laughs> what is the drink of the night? Yeah, not too good at hiding when I drink. Uh, it is generic Coke Cherry Coke. Or generic Kroger Cherry Coke. I really shouldn't be drinking that crap, but uh, I should be sticking the water, but... You know how it is. Farmer's Barricade. Oh, hello. It looks like you do know this guy. Oh, hey, whoa. What do you know? Ah, Campbell, my proud friend. How long I have waited. I see you have found yourself a pet. It smells weak, but I suppose there is some potential there. Watch what you say, beast, or I'll bind you as well. Bind me, a slave once more, Kim. It must be a bit a long fall from glory. But you always were soft, weren't you? Always favored, always the best. If it didn't know better, I'd say you even loved that Sith animal you called a master. Oh, they had a romance. Enough. I was not weak. You were weak. A slave to that monster, Orton Sela. I know a way to shut this guy up. Foolish Kem and foolish little Sith. Orton Sela cruel, was cruel as true. Petty and insignificant by all accounts. That was the only reason your pitiful master trusted him. And something about mistake. I'll let you have your fun with him. Wow, you, this guy sucks. Yeah, <laughs> he tanks as well as you do. Oh yo. Bishop R is dead, my master. You have my sympathy. He definitely doesn't want me to say that, because he hates weakness in any form. You're a sentimental fool. He probably doesn't want me to insult him. Did you really think he stood a chance against me? Memory has played me for a fool. Meshik, Tulakod, none of them were as I remember. I thank you for your help, my master, but it was neither needed nor desired. Uh, you asked for my help. Now, my master, if it pleases you, let us leave this dismal place and never speak of these ghosts again. What do you mean it wasn't desired? You asked for my help, asshole. How was it not desired? What a jerk. 
Why did we look in the chest? There was nothing in it. Maybe that was the credits? Hmm. A lot of XP though. 11,000. 11.1 K. That's pretty damn good for beating somebody's ass. That was pretty easy. Oh, hey, what's up? Settlers. Boom! Uh, this is what really makes him feel better. Beating up on a bunch of totally weak settlers. You feel better now, you got your aggressions out. Got a blue item. Uh, I would lose three endurance, lose one crit. Ooh, but I'd also gain force power, which it doesn't bother to tell me for some reason. Hell yes, I will take that. Wow, that's actually a pretty damn good upgrade. I mean, I lose a little endurance, but not enough to really cry over. Any more in here? Or is this going outside? I don't want to go outside yet. I'll make sure we've checked this area. Yeah, I don't know. I'm really undecided on this mask. <coughs> on one hand, it does kind of look cool. But on the other hand, my beautiful face is not shown. So that's, that's kind of a bummer. <laughs> you helped it. Delivered, master. Uh, you a-hole. That was an abundant yield, too. And of course, oh my god. Companion gifts, companion gifts, companion gifts, companion gifts, luxury fabrics. Fabrics. I hate you so much right now. Is there any rich yield? Of course not. Why would there be? Oh, that's level four. I want to do level three. Nope. You are a dick. I will perform according to your exacting specifications. No, you probably sir. won't. You probably won't. You will probably let me down yet again. <sighs> Alright. What time is it? Holy crap, it's 2.11. Damn, I came a long ass way. Baby. Let's, let's go ahead and pour all the way back. Because there was those quests in the, right in the beginning of town there. So let's start from the beginning. Bloody hell. Wait a minute. Oh, son of a bitch. This isn't where I thought it was. Displaying all authorized destinations. Yeah, this is where we want to go. Route is confirmed. See, I'm damned if I do, damned if I don't. If I put the stupid thing on mute, it makes that really annoying noise. That's the one thing I don't like about these. Like, I use uh, Sennheiser headphones, and they're really nice. But the one thing I hate is when you put put it on mute. It has that horrible noise. Yeah, for just an arid desert wasteland, it does look pretty nice. I mean, like I say, there's really only so much you can do with a deserted wasteland. 
without it no longer being a deserted wasteland. You know what I mean? If you spruce it up too much, then it's just not a deserted wasteland anymore. There's some birds flying in the air. Let's find so a better bargain. Junk. Oh, those are Kim Vol's old pants. Come back anytime. I mean, reverse engineer. Damn it. Well, either way, I need to. Uh, oh shit! T t turn off reverse engineering first. I've almost done that like three or four times. Armoring mod and enhancement. Okay, so. What do I need to replace? The armoring can stay because it's better willpower but only slightly less endurance. The uh, see the mod can stay. Um, it's definitely less endurance, which is sucks, but it's a lot more willpower. The enhancement, however, needs to go in because it's one more endurance and. 18 power, which is really better than crit for me, because that increases how much, even though it's not really that big of a deal. I think I'll wait. I think it's fine. It's not enough for me to really worry about. One thing I do want to replace, though, is, let's check, what is this? This mod. 17 strength, and he'd lose his one endurance, though, of course. Does he have something else that he can replace? Uh, he's only got one other orange item, which I need to fix that. I need to get him more oranges. Okay, this is the same endurance and 17 strength. Yeah, let's go with that. Not gonna bother taking it out. Another ma another National Republic game? I don't see that happening. I don't see that happening for a long time. If ever. New quest for Major Vire. Criminals and vagabonds. Everywhere on Tatooine, the Empire's great works are besieged by criminals and vagabonds. Major Vir, sir, you have a guest. This guy looks pretty clean for being in Tatooine. My hey, Lord, that rhymed. Such an unexpected pleasure. Guided to this backwards province to bring order and discipline, no doubt? It's like the kind of kid that's pushed around a lot at school. He's got the breathing apparatus going on. I have no idea what you mean. As I was just explaining to the lazy sots in my command. Oi. The Exchange Crime Syndicate is flagrantly defying the Empire's directives. They're banned by Imperial law, yet they've given refuge here to dozens of murderers, spice dealers. They've even started processing spice outside Mos Illa, and yet my men refuse to act. But sir, we lost 15 men in our last attempt. Quiet! I am well versed in this company's many failures. Clearly, I must turn elsewhere to see Imperial law restored. There's nothing I like more than a good purge. I'm pleased that you're so enthusiastic, my lord. The job is simple. The spice processing operation outside Mosilla must be completely obliterated, and its guards killed as a lesson. With their men dead and machinery destroyed, the message will be clear. I look forward to seeing you when it is done. Okay. 